Hello! In this video, I'm going to answer one of the most common questions I get. What gear do I use to run this channel? After about two years of working on this YouTube channel, I feel confident to explain all the tools and gear that I use as a YouTuber. I'll walk you through my helmet setup, including the camera, microphone, and headset, as well as the other cameras I use to make videos. I'll also walk through how I'm able to strap the bike to my sedan, all the tools I use to work on the bikes, and my entire editing setup. I'm not claiming this is the perfect e-bike YouTuber setup, but it is what works for me, and I hope this video offers some insight for you if you are thinking about starting a YouTube channel of your own. Without further ado, I'm actually gonna unbox the newest addition to my YouTuber setup, which I'm gonna pull out right now. You know it's a fancy chair when they include white gloves for the assembly. This is hilarious. These are actually super nice. It is absolutely beautiful today. Ready? Bang! Hand drag. What? Side to side. Front and back. Up and down. Come on. Adjust your seat height. Bang. All right. Now, the reason I'm excited about this desk is because it's got a beautiful carbon fiber top. It's got a built-in wireless charger for your phone and a little USB port there. If you are interested in this desk or chair, there will be a discount code down below. All right, here's the desk tour. So we've got the Samsung widescreen monitor, some generic keyboard, links will be down below. I got these crazy Logitech speakers that connect to this subwoofer. This speaker setup is outstanding. It vibrates the whole room. I love the sub. Everything's running through my Mac. It's kind of a mess down here. The Mac sits on a fan plate to keep it cool. Very convenient hook for the headphones and cup holder. Got the high-end Logitech mouse. I edit all my videos on iMovie. It does everything I need and absolutely nothing more. Export everything in 4K and upload it to YouTube. Very happy with this setup. Now, believe it or not, this is actually not my face. This is a helmet, a Fox V1. I've got the Havoc goggles with the magnetic lenses. On the inside, I have the Senna SF sound system for music. I can't ride without the music. And that headset comes with a microphone for phone calls. I've got a second microphone in there. It's a purple Panda lavalier mic, and that goes straight up into the GoPro, and that's what you're listening to right now. Absolutely essential for any moto vlogging. It's got the dead cat, so it's not too windy. You just need the GoPro. Pro audio adapter which I have plugged into my GoPro Hero 7 Black. It's not the newest GoPro but it's been holding up beautifully. It'll glitch out maybe once a month but I can deal with that. I've got the GoPro mounted under the visor. I think this is a great angle especially because you can tilt it back and see the screen while the helmet's still on. Very happy with this helmet setup. Let's move on. As far as cameras, I do most of my videos with the GoPro Hero 7 Black and my iPhone 12 Pro Max. I love using the iPhone for B-roll, especially when I'm out and about. For my sidearms, I've got pretty much the entire Insta360 lineup. I've got the original Insta360 One R. I've got the brand new Insta360 One RS. Both are 360 modular cameras, so you can do both 360 and standard lenses. I've also got the Insta360 One X2 and the Insta360 Go 2. This one is really great for the undercover footage. In almost every single video, I use this tripod setup. I've got the Insta360 tripod base that's collapsible, screwed onto the Insta360 invisible selfie stick with either a phone mount or a GoPro mount on top. This is my bike stand and my working stool. Both are very helpful, but neither are great. I wouldn't recommend them. Moving on, tools are absolutely essential. I've got this DeWalt toolbox that's the perfect size to fit everything you'd need to work on an e-bike. Got the upper cubby for the little things, sockets, electrical tape, bits, random screws, zip ties, zip tie cutter, super glue, tire patches. Now in the big compartment, Psych Plus electric pump. 
ratchet driver, wrenches, Allen keys, pipe thingy, Android phone for programming controllers, got the Ryobi drill, duct tape, Velcro, voltmeter, skate tool, rag, gloves, headlamp for that night work, this one's stupid bright, drill bits, bleed kit, spirit brakes, shout out my sponsor from Lithuania, and then a nice big socket set. In order to film at different locations, I need to haul the bike. That's where the 2018 Volkswagen Passat comes into play. I've got the 2-inch hitch installed, which allows me to put a Black Widow motorcycle carrier on. I've got the hitch stabilizer to keep it steady, and then it just takes two ratchet straps to keep this thing rock solid on the carrier. I like these ratchet straps because they have the clip hooks. It's an extra level of safety. And I also tie the extra strap for safety. This totally does the trick. You can also fit a second Suron in the back if you take the bars off. So there you go. That's everything I use as a YouTuber. If you have any questions, throw them in the comments below. As always, thank you so much for watching. And stay tuned. Yeah.